Hello, this is Richard Bishop of H3B Media. We're here at the eSafety Challenge 2010 in Millbrook looking at a variety of active safety systems throughout the exhibit hall. We're here with two people from the Denso exhibit, Jean-Michel Hinchos of Denso and Marcel Visser of Centurion Wireless Modules. The idea here is e-call. How does one implement e-call in a production vehicle? Marcel, tell us, tell us the first step. What has to be done at the electronics level? So what we did is, uh, like in, uh, in this module, we incorporated like, the foreseen minimum set of data transfer via the GSM Air. So in case the, uh, the e-call is, uh, is ignitioned, then this minimum set of data get by the car via the uh, GPS data is transferred over the network. So what we made is we made a kind of a GSM communication tool or a module that uh, can do this communication. Then this gets incorporated into a box and has to be integrated in the car and this is done by Denso. So what's and, the Denso approach? And the Denso approach is basically to take uh, this uh, GSM module and to integrate it in our, uh, in our box that is connected to our uh, can, to the CAN bus of the vehicle and then is able to uh, make the full link between the vehicle, the, the service center or the e-call center, and uh, finally uh, the emergency services. And that's, um, that's basically it mm -hmm. uh, in a very simple way. Would, would you say the, the system's ready to go? It's just a matter of being uh, adopted by the, the car makers at this point? It's, it's ready to go. It's basically the question is, uh, exactly to, for, for the car manufacturers to decide their specifications or their precise specifications beyond what uh, the EU is probably going to ask for uh, as a mandatory system, basically. That's, uh, that's it. Okay. That's very helpful. Thank you, gentlemen. Thank you. All right.